So what's the weather going to be like? Let's check in with Chief Forecaster John Malone. <laughs> Well, at least for tomorrow, it's going to be warmer, and that's good news for the folks who are going to stand in our driveway and collect all that food and for the people who are bringing the food out. Right now, it continues to snow. Here's the back edge of Doppler 4 radar uh, starting to push through the center of uh, Sheboygan County right now, uh, almost through Washington County right through the northwest part of Waukesha County and then all the way down into Walworth County. Here's the movement on Viper radar. It's uh, directly to the east at about 25 miles per hour back edge, starting to speed up a little bit. Most of the snow will be through Milwaukee County by about 730. Uh, revising the figures right now, we've got two reports of 2.1 inches of snow in the Madison area. So I think this general area of one to two and a half inches. This is for tonight only. Might even see another half to an inch of snow in the morning hours. Uh, right Right around the commute uh, in the morning, so watch out for that if it develops. Cold temperatures today, only 19 for a high in Milwaukee, 13 lacrosse, 9 in Wausau, and it's staying very cold. This is going to be very slick conditions. Salt is not going to work very well on this snow. 17 in Milwaukee, 12 Waukesha, 14 Port Washington, West Bend, 11 right now out in Watertown overnight tonight. Temperatures will be right around that uh, low teens in the area. 13 Watertown, 13 Beaver Dam, 12 Milwaukee and Waukesha. We'll actually see temperatures rising towards the morning hours as warmer air is pushing through, causing the snow. And another little burst could be around, as according to our computer models, in the morning hours, sometime between about 6 and 9 o'clock in the morning. Could see another half an inch with that. Then the next storm system is actually going to pass to our north, and it'll draw up warmer air. We're going to be in the upper 30s by Thursday, and our precipitation could fall as rain at times, but everything looks pretty light at this point. 28 in Milwaukee and Madison tomorrow, 30 in Chicago, 27 if you're going up to Green Bay. So we're going to see those temperatures jumping through the 20s for tomorrow. So we get that one to two inches of snow through the evening hours, early evening hours. Overnight low around 12 with temperatures rising towards the morning hours. And again, right at the mo at the Daybreak hours, we're going to see another burst of snow, it looks like. Could see another half inch there, so uh, you may want to get up a little early for your morning commute and check that out. 28 tomorrow is your high temperature with that morning flurry, sunshine in the afternoon. Not as cold tomorrow night, 14 degrees. And look at that, we're going to hit 30, finally, on Wednesday with partly cloudy skies. And that's right around where we should be for this time of the year. Here's your Storm Team for 10-day outlook up to 37 on Thursday, with a little light rain, scattered freezing drizzle or drizzle around. And then 31 on Friday with temperatures dropping all day and some light snow. 30 on Saturday, 25 on Sunday. And then for Christmas week, Christmas Eve, 28. Mm. No storms in sight. Christmas Day up to 34. Right there, if we don't hit 37 on Thursday, Christmas could be the warmest day of the month. Not too cold for <laughs> Santa then. Not too cold Christmas for Santa. Christmas is definitely. next week. Yeah. Here already. Yeah, a week Stressing. from Wednesday. <laughs> Thanks, John.